Hey there, Saki here from Saki Tech, and in today's video, I want to give you exact details on the Samsung Galaxy S9. We have had some precise leaks that basically reveal everything, including the exact day of the release date and specs, including the battery capacity. So let's dive in and come to know everything. And of course, if you do use Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, make sure to follow me on all at Saki Tech Online for the latest in tech. Let's dive in. So the release date, we have confirmation. The Galaxy S9 will be released on February 26th. Not only that, you can pre-order it March the 1st and it will start shipping March 16th. And how do we know this? An extremely reliable leakster known as Evan Blass just recently tweeted this information. He's well connected and got his information from a C-level executive of a major case maker company. Now a C-level executive is the highest level executive in an organization such as a CEO, CFO, or COO. So that's been confirmed and Evan Blass has the track record of rarely being wrong. So it is February 26th. That's a Monday. It will happen at Mobile World Congress in Barcelona, Spain. Now let's move on to the specs and reveal some exciting details. First and foremost, if you watched my previous video, you are aware that the Galaxy S9's retail box was leaked on Reddit by a user, which revealed an extraordinary fact. The Galaxy S9 will have AKG tuned stereo speakers and it will retain the 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. In the box, you will also get AKG tuned stereo earphones. This is absolutely fantastic news. I've been waiting for the stereo headphones for a while. Now other specs have been around for a while. Uh, the screen specs are exactly the same as S8 and the S8 Plus with a Quad HD Plus resolution and a Super AMOLED display. Of course, there will be slight improvements to the overall brightness and quality of the display. For the processor, we have a Snapdragon 845 for the US market and Exynos 9810 for non-US markets. The S9 will have four gigabytes of RAM while the S9 Plus might end up having 6 gigabytes of RAM. The S9 will have a single 12 megapixel camera while the S9 Plus will have a dual camera setup, both with 12 megapixels. Now these cameras will certainly have enhancements over predecessors. The battery life on the S9 is expected to be 3000 milliamp hours while the S9 Plus will have 3500 milliamp hours, which is the same as the S8 and the S8 Plus. Of course, we'll have tons of carryover features uh, such as wireless charging, IP68 grade water resistance, iris scanner, rear fingerprint sensor, which will be under the camera, and of course the DeX dock capability, and all that good stuff. There is an unverified rumor that suggests we might get facial recognition, some kind of advanced technology, but I'm gonna hold off on that for now. So that's basically everything that we know. At this point, we can fully visualize the S9 and the S9 Plus, and all we need is to see it live on February 26th, to confirm what we already know. Although I really hope there is some surprises in store. That is always welcome. So let me know what you think guys. Drop a comment down below and let me know if you will keep the S8 or upgrade to the S9. Maybe you have the Note uh, or maybe you are waiting for the S9 so as to choose between the S9 and the iPhone 10. Just drop comments, thoughts, concerns below. Make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech and follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at Saki Tech Online. Guys, have a fantastic day. We are getting closer.